How can a beginner navigate metaphysics and separate the wheat from the chaff? My reply. The trail anyone blazes through any field of studies corpus of data for research depends entirely on the desired goal that individual person has in entering into that field. If you want to grow up to be a biochemist, you'd have little need to study geology. And likewise, if your primary interest is in meteorology, you would have little need to study neurosurgery and so forth. So if you enter into studying metaphysics and you want to get something specific out of it, you will likely end up finding a way to twist the concepts to fit your desired outcome. Just so, modern metaphysics has been muddled with postmodern theosophy and ideas about the nature of God or gods, which are not substantiated by the actual data. If you study metaphysics, expecting to get out of doing so only a broader mind and a more well-rounded personal education, then you should read everything regardless of whether you or anyone else believes it to be wheat or chaff. You have to decide for yourself what you will attract toward in your own psychic explorations. I realize, of course, nowadays nobody can literally read everything. That would take too long, be too redundant, and require sifting through too much worthless junk data that is not pertinent to one's purpose in studying the field. But one should decide for themselves what constitutes wheat and what chaff relative to their own personal goals, and to, to do that requires reading some things you might not agree with. <laughs>